WTFNN. Headline news update. Hi, everyone. This is the uh, TFNN update. This is the noontime update with Basil Chapman, the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming up straight after this update. So here we go. Dow's up 122 at 26,340. It is being held up 10 in Boeing, Boeing at 395. Uh, maybe there's a little bit of good news there for Boeing, and it's acting accordingly. Uh, but what's really interesting for me is that the MACD and Stochastic in the daily chart of the Dow Acting very well, even though this is a leg E in the Chapman wave, this is where we start to become cautious, where you expect some kind of resistance levels. But Boeing is definitely helping the Dow at this particular time. Look how the weekly chart broke out of resistance, very strong technicals. So that's saying that any sudden sharp pullback, the 25,950s should be very strong support. Um, over the next uh, week, if there is a pullback, the S&P didn't make a new high today, but it's traveling uh, up there in that resistance area at 28.73, up 0.39, had a high yesterday of 28.2885.25. So um, how it handles the support is going to be important today in the 28.67 area. But over the next week, the, the low that was made on that gap up on the 1st of April at 20, the gap open was 28.48. That's going to be really important support over the coming week. The QQQs, now this is fascinating because look, QQQ didn't make a higher high above yesterday's 184.92. Technicals are pretty good. The weekly technicals are very strong. But the XLK, this is the S&P, this is the Select Tech Spider Fund. Made an all-time, well, it missed by two cents, making an all-time high yesterday above the 78.27 high of October. Went to 78.26. Uh, this is fantastic action for a V-shaped pattern. I suspect that it's going to try to get there, uh, but this is the area of resistance that you're going to be watching closely. I want to just get to gold quickly because gold is down. Three at 12.92 it was down much more earlier on. It went under the 200 period moving average, and the dollar right now, the dollar is holding quite nicely at 29 at 97.28. I'll be back. We we'll talk about these currencies. We we'll talk about yields. We we'll talk about uh, crude oil when I get back for my Tiger Technicians Hour. Stay tuned. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow.